morning, we're getting a few friendly reminders when it comes to ice safety. Emily Dean is live in Oshkosh with more. Hi, Em. Good morning, Rachel and Phil. Hi, everybody. Okay, imagine this. You're going out for the holiday weekend. You're going to go on the ice to do a little ice fishing. What if you fall through? Would you know how to get out? Well, we have a few examples this morning to help you if you do venture out. We're on Miller's Bay this morning in Oshkosh. I have Don Herman, who is here with me with Sunk Dive and Ice Service in Oshkosh. Don, good morning to you. Morning. All right, this is what we're going to do, guys. We're actually going to be going in the water. So I'm just walking on the ice, venturing out, and all of a sudden, I fall through. Uh, Dad, what do I do? Okay, the first thing you want to do, well, you're going to be panicking. Yep. You know that. And you can see how it's hard with your suit on. Yep. You're going to panic. So what you want to do is get try to come out on your chest Kay. with your elbows. If you don't have picks, which you have on, and it's hard. And, you, and just imagine if someone's wet, wet. And now what and do I do have, now? And then you roll. Once you get out so far, you want to keep going this way and you want to try to roll. Okay. And then get back on your chest. You always want to roll and you just keep going until you get the good ice and then stand oh. up. Don, that's hard. And I'm wearing a suit that you actually use for diving. Imagine if you were wearing something else. I couldn't. <clears throat> you can't. Because remember, the ice is going to keep breaking. Yeah. Until you get the good ice. And then hypothermia <laughs> starts setting in. And you were telling me how fast could hypothermia set in? About five minutes. And this water is cold. Okay, it's not warm this morning. All right, Don, we got another example. Of you guys, I'm going back in. If you're with someone and you go in, someone goes in, you know, the other guy has to stay back and you get a rope to you, this is going to make it a lot easier for you. And you have the other guy pull you out. Oh, yeah. So that makes it a lot easier for you. These are just safety tips. And then if you can't get out, you always got to remember that's where you had that whistle. When, when you're in the water, you can't. Can't talk? Can't talk. You're panicking? Some really great tips, Don. Thank you so much for being with us this morning. You're Good um, work, Emily. Wow. Nice job. Hey, Very it nice. was all done. Don taught me everything, you guys. But coming up, too, if you do want to enjoy the winter activities, we're actually going to be heading to a local indoor ice skating arena, so you won't want to miss that in the oh, 7 to okay. 8 o'clock hour. Yeah, but for now, we'll send it back to you. I'm okay. going gonna, gonna to change. Yeah, go warm up, too. <laughs> really good work. Thanks, Don.